I tried four games on the ITEL S23 Plus and the results were shocking. Even though I wish ITEL had used a more known processor brand like the ones from MediaTek and Snapdragon, after playing games on this phone, I feel like the T616 chip used on here is underrated. The T616 chip has an Antutu benchmark score of about 250,000 and it is capable of running up to 14GB of RAM compared to the 10GB max RAM the MediaTek G90 can handle. But we need more than benchmark scores to know the true performance and endurance of a device. That's why I tried playing four games on this ITEL S23 Plus. We started gaming when the battery was at 80%. As part 9 ran smoothly at high visual quality and after about 20 minutes of gaming, the phone was still very responsive and the temperature was around 36 degrees Celsius. eFootball 2024 was also smooth at high graphics and 60 frames per second but I did notice some lag. After another 20 minutes, the temperature was still around 36 degrees Celsius and the battery had reduced by just 6%. It was time for FIFA 2024 and it ran at medium graphics, highest resolution and 60 frames per second settings. Although the sound was a bit choppy, there was no loss in quality and the temperature still stayed around 36 degrees. Finally, we played Call of Duty at medium graphics quality and high frame rate settings. The temperature still stayed at 36 degrees and the battery had only dropped by 6%. So after about 20 minutes of total gameplay, the battery dropped from 80% to 56%. Pretty cool in my opinion. The full gaming performance test is on my YouTube channel. Like, share and follow for more.